since SpaceX announced their first all-civilian mission to space, I've been obsessed. I just love space in general. I think it's interesting. Although I'm not going yet, or possibly ever, because it seems a little scary. Um, I know one unbelievably cool person who is Haley Arsenault as a physician assistant for St. Jude Children's Research Hospital and a bone cancer survivor herself. Haley will actually be one of four crew members aboard SpaceX's Dragon spacecraft. So cool. When it heads into orbit later this year, she'll also be making history as the youngest American ever to travel to space. Let's talk with this inspiring woman. What's up, Haley? Hi, Kelly. Hello. Thank you for having me. Absolutely. I'm, I'm so excited for you. This is such a cool thing. Like, n nobody, literally almost nobody gets to do what you're going to do. So how did you become a part of the mission? So Inspiration4 is the name of our mission, and it's serving as the world's first all-civilian mission to space. And the idea for this mission was by this philanthropist named Jared Isaacman, who wanted to use this first all-civilian mission for good and to benefit St. Jude Children's Research Hospital, the very place that saved my life. And we're going to raise a bunch of awareness for the hospital, and we're hoping to raise $200 million, which I am so jazzed about. But I have been chosen to go along to represent hope and to represent pediatric cancer patients everywhere, and hopefully to show these kids that the sky is not even the limit. And to keep hope because hope is priceless. Hope is priceless, amen. Well, what will be your role um, on the SpaceX crew? So I'm a physician assistant by trade, and so I've been selected to be the medical officer of the flight, which I think is the coolest title ever. Uh, absolutely, I feel like you're in Star Trek right now. Um, I'm <laughs> very impressed. So what are, what are you most looking forward to? Um, I'm so excited to start space training in just a few weeks. And of course, seeing the Earth from space. But you know, I'm most excited to video chat with the St. Jude patients while we're in space. I think it's gonna be so cool for them to interact with somebody who's in space floating around. But you know, I think on another level, it's gonna be really meaningful to them to show them what their future can look like. And I hope it really shows them to dream big. Absolutely. Um, well, for details on how you can support this mission, cause you should, check out our Instagram story. Thank you so much, Haley, and good luck on this fantastic mission to space. So Thank stoked for you. you. Yep, I'm still here. Just waiting for you to subscribe. If you don't, I'll be trapped in this box forever.